Climate Change Effect on Marine Animals by Luke Wagner Over the years, humans have been using tons of greenhouse gases, such as carbon dioxide, methane, and others, which have gone up in the air affecting climate change all around the world. We are experiencing this, and so are marine animals such as polar bears, penguins, whales, turtles, fish, seals, etc., etc. Climate change is having a big effect in the Arctic from the melting ice, making it thin or getting rid of it completely. The polar bears live here, so climate change is making life a little harder to live for them. These bears use the ice for resting and hunting on. Their energy and time for hunting is being reduced because of the melting ice. If these bears don't have enough time for taking care of themselves, then they won't have enough time for reproduction. The temperature rising over the years means that there were once large areas of ice where there is now ocean water. Climate change is also having an effect on right whales. North Atlantic right whales, which can grow to be 55 feet long and 77 tons, are also being affected by climate change. There are less than 500 right whales left in the world. This is an endangered animal that has been affected by humans killing them off and global warming due to climate change. Food sources for this whale are the key to surviving and reproducing. The dense patches of zooplankton that the females eat allow them to bulk up for calving so they can reproduce enough milk. Seawater temperature, wind, and water currents affect the formation of the zooplankton patches. The warming seawater is affecting how dense the patches are. If the patches aren't dense enough, the females won't be able to bulk up. Shifts of zooplankton populations affect the right whale too. Climate change is also having an effect on codfish. Codfish in the Atlantic Ocean have a limit of water temperature in which they can reproduce and grow bigger. 54 degrees Fahrenheit is the maximum temperature that they can survive at, and above 47 degrees Fahrenheit is the level that codfish refuse to survive and grow. Over the years, codfish have really decreased in population in the Atlantic from the warmer water due to climate change. Climate change is also affecting penguins. Different things caused from climate change are affecting many different kinds of penguins. Antarctica is warming up quickly so the ice is getting smaller. Emperor penguin chicks and adults are being hurt because of this. The adults keep the chicks in their rear to protect them on sea ice. If the sea ice breaks off, it is more likely for them to be swept away into the water and die. Penguins' food source is going down. With less sea ice, that means there is less algae where the penguins hunt for krill. The krill like to feed near the algae. If the algae isn't there anymore, then the krill won't be either for the penguins. All of these terrible chain reactions are happening because of us. We are using all of these greenhouse gases to pollute the world, causing the climate to change. Now there are even more problems with marine animals than we had before.